Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another new video. In this video, I am going to tell you all few books in which I used in my second year. So before starting the books, let me introduce with all the subjects of second year. There are total six subjects and first one is pathology and microbiology. Both of them are combined. In pathology, you have to study all the diseases and in microbiology, all the microorganisms or autoclave, uh, disinfectants, everything, hospital acquired infection. So pathology is, will be of 50 marks and microbiology will be of 30 marks. So for pathology, I use the best book, Harsh Mohan. So this is Harsh Mohan and this is the review of the Harsh Mohan. You will get this review along with this book. So you can just refer Harsh Mohan. Everything in this book is given in a proper detailed manner of morphology or histology, everything. So if you wish to study pathology in a very deep manner or you have interest in pathology, you can refer Harsh Mohan. This is Ramdas Naik. In this book, everything is given in a very uh, prescribed manner, like in answer format, I would say. So, if you don't wish to study pathology in a deeper manner, you can use Ramdas Naik. This is another book, Essentials of Pathology for Physiotherapy Students. It is also by Harsh Mohan. So, you can also get this book if you wish. There is another book called Robbins. It will be of two volumes, volume 1 and volume 2. You can use this book for a few topics. Second subject is microbiology. For microbiology, I used C.P. Baveja and Anand Narayan. In Anand Narayan, the topics are given in a very detailed manner, like as Harsh Mohan. But you can study from C.P. Baveja, it is sufficient. But for few topics like immunology or any diseases like syphilis, you can refer this book. It is not like ki many ones book recommend ki hai. It is all up to you that you can see which book is going to be, which book is going to be. The third subject is pharmacology. As I said in my previous video, pharmacology is all about the drugs, their classification, their mechanism of action, their side effects. So yes, you need to rectify all the drugs and their classification. So for classification purpose, I would highly recommend you all to get this KD Tripathi. In this book, classifications are given in a proper sorted way. Confusion will be less and you will remember your drugs in a proper manner. And how to remember your drugs, I have said it in my previous video. You can just check it out. And for other content like side effects or mechanism of action, you can use this book, Padma Chaudhary Kumar. And another edition of Padma Chaudhary Kumar is Medical Pharmacology. So yes, all these three books you can use for your pharmacology subject. Next subject is Psychology including Psychiatry. For psychiatry, I use this book, Neeraj Ahuja. So psychiatry is all about the mental disorders like hallucinations, schizophrenia, mood disorders. And psychology is the theory part like learning, thinking, memory of the human mind. For psychology, I use this book, Psychology for Physiotherapist. You also can use MUNS. In MUNS, the topics are in a more detailed way and some topics which are not given in this book, you can refer from MUNS. Next subject is kinesiology. So what is kinesiology? Kinesiology is just the biomechanics. If your anatomy is strong from the first year itself, you will find kinesiology very very easy. In this you just have to learn the forces which act when a particular movement takes place. The bone is gliding, sliding, rolling, all that. The types of joint and the classification of joints, everything. So this is very interesting subject if your anatomy is strong. Kinesiology, you should refer Cynthia Norkins and you should have this book. You can't issue it from the library or just don't take a print out of it. This is the major book, so you need to buy it. Next subject is electrotherapy. So many of them take it for granted, but no, if you take it for granted, it's not like that. You should study electrotherapy, and the major, major, very basic book is Clayton. The physics part is given in a very good manner. Cryotherapy or UVR, they are also explained in a very proper way. The most trending book among the students is B.K. Nanda because in this book uh, the language is very easy and uh, very understandable. So you can also refer this B.K. Nanda but just don't rely on B.K. Nanda. You should also use Jagmohan Singh or Luan Reed. This is Jagmohan Singh. For practical purpose Jagmohan Singh is very good. You can uh, read SD curve, Parallelism Under Pressure or Paddock Footpath from Jagmohan Singh. And there are many other topics. So for practical, you can refer Jagmohan Singh. There is also this book, Low and Read, but it is a bit difficult to understand. So it is up to you if you want to buy it or not. It's not like the books which I recommend are only books you should use. The books which you buy, it all depends on your understanding level and how fast you grasp it. 
so there are many books just take it from the library read the topic from two different books and see which book suits you and buy accordingly okay the last subject is kinesiotherapy it is all about exercising breathing exercise stretching strengthening mmt posture assessment everything so the basic book which you should have is dina gardner and the first chapter of dina gardner fully important chapter all the questions will be asked in first year from this book even in second year you should have this book second is lakshmi narayan in this book gait walking aids and frankel exercise everything is explained in a proper manner like ek bar pad liya to dimag mein ghus gaya and for first year suspension therapy is also explained in a very good manner so you can issue it from your library next book is kendall in this book mmt and posture assessment part is given in a very good manner so you don't need to buy it for the two topics you can just take a print out of it or take a photo or issue it from the library for the days you want the last and the major book is kisner so in this book all the exercise all the treatment part everything is given in a proper manner coordination exercise balance exercise stretching strengthening everything is explained in a proper way so you should have this book so that's it these were the subjects which are in the second year it the subjects may differ from university to university but in mhs this is the pattern so i am ending this video if you have found it helpful do share it with your physiotherapy friends and if you have any doubts related to the books you can mention it in the comments below so that i can help you out and if you are new here do subscribe to my channel and see you all in the next video bye bye